In order to understand hearing loss, you have to understand the anatomy of the ear. Sound comes in through the ear canal and impacts on the tympanic membrane. And as the tympanic membrane vibrates, the bones behind the eardrum also are set into vibration. Um, and as this little stapes bone vibrates, it sets the fluid into motion in the inner ear. So uh, you have to understand that we have three different parts of the ear. We have the ear canal, the external ear, we have the middle ear, and we have the inner ear. And in order to understand hearing loss, you have to realize that. You can have problems with each one of these different areas and develop hearing loss. So uh, a conductive hearing loss, is, as the name implies, is, is a hearing loss where conduction is impaired or blocked. And conduction can be impaired by wax in the ear canal. It can be impaired by a congenitally um, a closed off ear canal. It can be impaired by a tumor of the ear canal. It can be impaired by a hole in the eardrum. It can be impaired by a process in the middle ear, like fluid. It can be impaired by a tumor, a cholesteatoma, uh, in the middle ear. Um, and it can also be impaired by fixation of the little stapes bone, or a condition called otosclerosis. So in conductive hearing loss, the inner ear is working great. But the problem is the sound is not quite getting to the inner ear. So when an audiologist, a specialist who does hearing tests, uh, tests you, uh, what they typically do is they put a stimulator up against uh, the bone behind your ear. And what we're doing here is we're stimulating the inner ear directly. And usually the hearing is excellent uh, when they put the stimulator right on the bone. However, when they put the stimulator in the ear canal, you start having difficulties because you've got a blockage uh, of sound getting to the inner ear. So in a nutshell, that's conductive hearing loss. Another kind of hearing loss is sensory hearing loss. And a lot of people use the term sensory neural hearing loss, but it's actually inaccurate. Sensory hearing loss implies a problem with the cochlea, with the inner ear, with the hair cells of the inner ear, or the ultrastructure or the architecture of the inner ear. Um, neural hearing loss uh, implies a problem with the nerve. And what we're talking about here is a problem with the hearing nerve, the nerve that connects the cochlea to the brainstem. So uh, three different kinds of hearing loss, conductive hearing loss, sensory hearing loss, uh, typically caused by the aging process, uh, ototoxic medicines. There are some medications that will also give you a hearing loss. And neural hearing loss, typically from tumors uh, behind the inner ear.